Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to start a manual car. So the first thing that you are going to do is use your left foot to push down the clutch pedal completely. So I'm going to use my left foot and I'm going to push the clutch pedal completely down. Then I'm going to use my right foot to push down the brake pedal, just like that. So now the clutch pedal and the brake pedal are being pushed down. Now one thing that you will notice is that the clutch pedal can be pushed pushed down much more than the other pedals. So you will notice that the clutch pedal is being pushed down much further than the brake pedal. Now we are going to turn the key to start the car. Just like this. And I'm not going to move my feet. They are staying in those positions. So now that the car has been started, I'm going to keep my feet in those positions and we have to determine whether the um, gear selector is in neutral. So before we move our feet, we have to make sure that the gear selector is in neutral. So in order to see, um, to verify that the gear selector is in neutral, we have to be able to move it to the left and to the right substantially. So I'm just going to move it to the left and to the right. And as you can see, I can move it quite a bit to the left and to the right. And that means that the gear selector is in neutral. So I can now release my, uh, my left foot on the clutch pedal, just like this. And because the e-brake is on, I can also release my right foot from the brake. And now that's basically it. That is how you start a manual car. Now, if the gear selector does not move back and forth, so I'm just going to reverse. I'm putting my feet back to where they were. And if the gear selector is not in neutral, so let's say it doesn't move. I'll just put the car in first gear. Let's say you're moving it and it only moves that much. You will have to move the gear selector into neutral before you can release the pedals. So to do that, you are going to either pull it down or push it up slightly. So because it is in the top position, I'm going to pull it down and then you'll feel it sort of pop into place. And now it's in neutral. If it was, instead of being in the top position of the gear selector, if it was in one of the bottom positions, just like this, you can see that it's, I can't move it much. It's not in neutral. I'm going to push it up until it pops into place and then it's in neutral as you can see and once again once the once you have verified that the gear selector is in neutral you can release both your uh, the clutch pedal and then if the handbrake or the emergency brake has been engaged you can also release um, your right foot from the brake pedal and that's basically it that is how you start a manual car and that's all I have for you today thanks for watching